Well, here we are. Office day. Is this the intro? Eric said that this is the only time we'll ever use the pizza oven and that that's it. But I say, and Nick agreed very quickly, that this will be a semi-regular thing and we'll keep coming up with recipes and improving and then that will it all goes into the cookbook. Hi, welcome F to the Face cooks the hi, food. Hi, welcome to the supplementary <laughs> episode of <laughs> Face. We've gotten together at Jeff's house to cook these pizzas. But this is is like, how you set the scene. But this is like 20 minutes into the pizza video, isn't it? Is this a separate thing? Are we not are, are, not, are we not releasing like audio of this? As an audio podcast? Oh, oh this is an audio thing. Oh. Are you for real? Oh. See, this is why he produces. What? It's an audio podcast. He's right. He's totally right. <laughs> there are people I'm who totally just want this. Want He's right. totally right. <laughs> yeah. No, you're right. You, that's a good you point. You nailed it. <laughs> well, in that case, let me just say, we just filmed episode, what, 128 yesterday? Uh -huh. Yeah. And then to this yep. today, Eric has been on point with the <laughs> intros. I nominate Eric for season five intro guy. And this is, yeah. it's so easy to set the scene and then you go. I don't. Welcome to F Face Supplementary Pizza Podcast number one, office day number two. Not quite sausage talk. It's Jeff. Pizza it's Gavin. Talk. It's Andrew. Uh, Nick and Emily also mm -hmm. here. Uh, we're re we're recording live at Jeff's house. Jeff and Emily's house. I'm sorry, Emily. Um, <laughs> Jeff and Emily's house, which is beautiful, Emily. It's absolutely gorgeous. Um, Only she gets the compliment for that. <laughs> Yeah, as if, I'm, <laughs> as if I'm some design I, scrub. I, I I will say I don't think it would look like this if you were to decorate it. Um, <laughs> um, Andrew is uh, in his home in Canada. I am, and is yeah. trying to make a similar pizza, and that's the scene. Take it away. Well, uh, yeah, I don't know. It's similar is uh, I went a completely different direction. Not, I went with not a really similar. basic okay. yeah. pizza, to be honest. Uh, I did ask Eric to forward me the list of ingredients that they were going to get, uh, but then Jeff just decided to make a pepperoni pizza, so I didn't feel like I needed to follow well, up. Well, I still made my pizza. Just so you know, pepperonis on the list. There you go. Yeah. Oh, it was. So what did you make? Absolutely was. Do you want to see us uh, first? Or did, do you wanna... I did a very basic uh, barbecue base pizza with some cheese. It's a cheese barbecue pizza. What kind of barbecue sauce did you use as the base? Uh, I used a uh, a Rufus Teague barbecue sauce as the base sauce. Is Rufus yeah, Teague a famous Canadian barbecue master? I don't know anything about... What was the woman that made the baskets? I know less about the barbecue <laughs> guy than I know about Leona Waddell, I think was her name, on the scale of knowing. Can I, can I ask, are you saying that you just put barbecue sauce instead of tomato sauce and then put cheese on top of it? Yeah, yep, that's exactly what I did. Huh. Doesn't right. that usually have chicken or something on it? No, it absolutely. Yeah, I didn't have chicken. <laughs> Wasn't on the list. <laughs> I'll tell you what, Andrew. I didn't have any of the stuff that I used today. We just got it. No, that's fair. Yeah, I just, you know, I... Listen, I'm cooking out of a skillet. If we want to be honest, I realized phase one, I was in trouble when last night I went to remove my dough from the freezer, which had been there a while, and uh, I learned it expired like seven months ago, so I didn't have much hope for this, just generally speaking. He was gonna um, make pizza so I, I, any day I now for it. about a year. Is now is that in your little mini fridge in your bedroom? No, no, no. This is a proper fridge. I don't oh. have a freezer in my little mini fridge. fridge. So this is properly frozen. Uh, but yeah, the yeast was uh, was not not great. Probably died. Didn't rise very much. <laughs> Kind of flat, kind of hard, in ways I can't describe. So like, you... I, maybe that's the death of the yeast in the dough. I've taken a variety of photos now to show you my dough. Oh, I can't wait. I've made several pizzas this morning. Should we switch to a... So, so, yeah, what did you, so what did you do then? What do you mean, what did I do? Did you use the seven-month expired dough? Yeah, absolutely. I did. It's dough. It's been frozen this entire time. You're going to... You're gonna die. Don't eat He's that. He's gonna no, get botulism. No, no, it's just the, it's just yeast. It's just the yeast that died. I'm not gonna die. The yeast it's died. Only some of it that's dead. All right. Well, why don't you show us? Okay. Uh, let me let me pull up my phone. So this has been a journey as a whole. So I'm gonna show you guys mine before I get to see the pizzas that that you made. Yeah. I'm yeah. Guessing based on the setup. Okay. Yeah. So we're gonna we're gonna go on a little bit of a journey. So I used a skillet, <laughs> the tiny waffle maker skillet version you guys had. So this is. This is my first. This is my first attempt. Okay, so I made a tiny little baby pizza. I used a, a McDonald's million dollar game piece for scale, oh, so oh, you can see the oh, size of oh, how tiny oh, it is. God, I went with a tiny little pizza. He made pizza chips. Is, oh. What do you say? Pizza 
chips. That sounds amazing. Yes, yeah, it's, it's, it's a little pizza chip. That's a great idea. I thought about getting Pringles pizza chips to maybe put those in the mix, but I didn't. So I let that cook. I wasn't confident it would cook at all. Yeah. It did. It rose. It even rose. There's still some yeast <laughs> alive in that son of a bitch. And I prepared a second tiny little pizza, did it get which I put smaller? on. And let me say, it looked fucking delicious as it cooked. <laughs> It Is rose and cooked. We got a little cheese a- going. Actually, <laughs> looked pretty goddamn good. So that's my tiny. That's the it's tiny little pizza bite. I had. And every time, every pizza I made, I got like Italian pizza hands because I'd make a pizza and I'd grow confident. So we finished the little guy, oh, put wow. that to the side. We start working bigger. We're getting a little bit bigger with every little pizza. I ate the little one. Honestly, delicious. It was fantastic. It's fantastic pizza. I ate the second one. Uh, that that you see next to it as well. I cooked that up. Uh, I took a bite. I was so excited. I, I ate it before I even could take a photo. <laughs> very doughy. Very it was very doughy. doughy. Didn't cook all the way through was the problem uh, on that one. But we kept trying, and we just kept getting bigger. We got to get more cheese in the mix. Oh, wow. Uh, That's, so oh, wow. You are, got that, pe- got that your going. Your pizza confidence is growing. It is incredible. It is, yeah. It has grown exponentially. Got that, got that cooking in the skillet. Uh, I couldn't close the lid because it was burning the top of the cheese, which was a problem I should have considered uh, beforehand. So we went open-faced yeah. on that one, and this is what is currently uh, sitting next to me, ready to be enjoyed. It's, it's going to be very doughy. It doesn't look very much like a pizza. It's barbecue but, uh, I tried. sauce. It's barbecue sauce on dough with some cheese melted on top. Yeah. <laughs> you can't really see the pizza. What? The, the crust is, is that the crust of the top? Yeah, we, it's spilled over quite uh, a lot. I've it looks like the blob from the blob. Yeah. <laughs> it, <laughs> it looks like remnants of like the marshmallow man from Ghostbusters. <laughs> like you shot a chunk off him. <laughs> yeah, it's not great. It's gonna be bad. But the little ones I'm telling you were fucking delicious. They look pretty they good. They look baby. delicious. That little baby one. I'm gonna go oh, back to that. The little that baby looks, one is the way to go. Let's stay on that. Yeah, that looks phenomenal. Okay, there you go. That, I love that. Yeah, I'm not. He kind of fell to his That's pizza cool. hubris, like. You got pretty confident. It's like confidence, quality. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah, it's a great scale. Whew. I'm excited to see what, what you all did. I had a belief going in that mine would be undercooked and yours would be charcoal. Okay. Was okay. how I assumed well. it would go. <laughs> okay. Uh, I which... said yesterday that it would be two ends of a different shit spectrum. <laughs> <laughs> now, uh, which which do you want to start? Do you want to start with Jeff's pizza or do you want to start with Gavin's pizza? Or Eric's. I mean, Eric's. I, mean I, I made a baby one. Though. Oh, Eric made a pizza well, too? yours might be good to start with because it would take over from oh, his side. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we can grow in size. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We'll all present our pieces to you, Andrew. I'll monitor the camera. Okay. So we're, your pizza is slightly bigger? Is that what you're saying? This is Eric's baby. This is my baby pizza. Hang on. Oh, this is Eric's. That looks delicious. Thank you. <laughs> that looks great. You gonna tell him what's... So it's a, it's a regular pepperoni pizza. And uh, yeah. I did a crescent roll stuffed crust with mozzarella cheese mm-hmm. around the outside. So... That's fantastic. There you go. I'm pretty happy about that. All right. That looks... Del- I, w- I want a piece of that. Right? Not bad. That so looks that's, great. That's the first... Andrew, that's the first of our pizzas. Um, do we want to go to Jeff's now? I think we should go to Jeff's. Because that's, that's sort of the whole thing. Right? And, and then we can tuck in all together right. at the yeah, same time. Yeah. Because yeah. Jeff's is very similar, I believe. It's just a pepperoni pizza as well, from what I understand. Yeah, this is a, a nice, lovely pepperoni. I don't like the way he's got the knife out. That's... It, we don't have a pizza cutter. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? That's not It's overcooked for sure, but it's not nearly as bad as I expected. Well, that looks like a side. store-bought oh, okay. Sorry, pizza. That all. doesn't look like a pizza. How's that? Uh, yeah, I, it looks fine. Wow, he's not impressed. Wow, he doesn't give a fuck about. He was so complimentary of mine. He didn't give yeah, a fuck it was about okay. Yours. It's a little too flat. He for didn't me. care. I like a All thicker right. crust, personally. Okay. Okay. And now, um, Gavin. Oh, I'll, I'll be right back, Andrew. Oh, you want to take your? Okay, okay. cool. Let me set this down. So far, I'm I'd excited. Say Eric is winning. <laughs> well, thank you. Yeah, hard disagree. Oh, uh, he's not yeah, gonna be very nice. nice. <laughs> oh. Gavin said Andrew's not gonna be very nice. All right, Andrew, you ready? Let's see. Plowman's. Yeah, let's see the yours. Plowman's pizza. I'm okay. Well, it looks like it was made by a plowman. Uh, <laughs> it has your staple to it. Let me introduce that... you to some of the ingredients. <laughs> mm-hmm. um, okay. Obviously, we've got the Branson pickle stuffed uh, crust that Eric decided we should make. We've got uh-huh. some ham under there, all English cheddar. We've got oh, some Jesus. boiled eggs sliced. We've got some chutney. We've got some piccalilli. And under one side, is a load of pickled oh. onion. <laughs> that, look, that looks so side. bad. 
<laughs> that looks terrible. It looks like whoever cooked it realized the Branston was shit and tried to burn it out. Just like all of your edges are fucked. Well, by the way, this happened uh, within about 16 seconds of being in there. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait to see the video. Well, the presentation oh my is God. done. Right, so Jeff should... left to go get another soda. Um, well, oh, he grabbed plates. Plates, now. yeah, because then okay. we can all try some of each. So we're going to try each of these pizzas. Which one do we want to yep. try first? We want to go down the line. We want to save Branston for last. Or do you yeah. Wanna, you want to tuck right oh, into it? Because then we'll be full. We won't need to eat it. <laughs> Thank you. Um, okay. I guess we'll, uh, God, what a knife. Great knife. Okay. We're going to uh, tuck into my tiny pet. So here we have uh, Eric's tiny Ratman pizza. <laughs> we have uh, Jeff's <laughs> simple pepperoni pizza. And we have Gavin's Plowman special. <laughs> All three are going to go in the recipe book. Look at that. Oh. Imagine if this was a pizza cutter. That would be crazy. He's really, he's really, really hung up on the pizza cutter. Uh, thing. Yeah, well, it's part of you know cutting a pizza. That just saying, just flat. it worked fine. Uh, Jeff, you want a little slice? Yeah, baby, of course. The only one I don't want is Gavin's. But oh, I'll... come on now. No, I'm gonna have some. <laughs> Gavin, do we like all eat at the same time, or can I go? Now? Yeah. Well, I'll wait. Well, I'll wait. Yeah, I'll wait. Yeah, I'll wait. Be patient. I'm starving. Mm -hmm. Now, do well, you good? We have a Gavin, bunch of pizzas. Do you think that eat? this? Do you think your pizza is going to taste better than the condiment you made? If we're going to compare previous <laughs> creations. Let's not bring up condiments while we're all in person. All right, let's uh, give it a try. Mmm. Mm. Pepperoni pizza. Mm. Mm -hmm. There's cheese. There's pepperoni. There's dough. dough. I can taste though. How's the stuffed crust? The dough flavor is there. Stuffed crust is good. This is a good pizza. That looks like again. a great pizza. I think if we learn how to control the temperature and then learn what temperature we need to cook at, mm -hmm. we can really dial that in. <laughs> Should we try that one? Absolutely. Yeah, I'll cut it up. If only I had a pizza cutter, right? <laughs> He's saying it like that, but now he has to cut the pizza, so I guess we'll wait and see. Uh, so for those listening, when moving on to Jeff's pepperoni. Mm -hmm. yeah, you, should, you really should be watching this, but... This video is on YouTube as well, so you mm -hmm. can see. Uh, there's also a video of the process of the pizza mm -hmm. being made. Or maybe it's just one video. Or maybe it's just one video. Gavin said, please, only make me make one video. <laughs> well, I'm not making this bit, so it's fine, right? <laughs> Who's making this bit? Is this? Oh, this is audio. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was just video. It's good. It's a freaking camera. Yeah. Andrew, I'm kind of bummed that you're not here to eat the pizza with us. Yeah, honestly, seeing both of your pizzas made me realize that my pizza is barely pizza. Nick, I gave you the it, it reduced. I was feeling good about my pizza until I looked at, at yours and Jeff's. I was feeling good about my pizza until I looked at mine. I would never feel good about what you made. That's on you. Jeff got that big slice. So fuck it. I deserve it. Mm -hmm. Okay. You cooked them. We tucking into this one? Yep. Yeah, let's tuck, tuck in. Mm. Oh. Oh, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Emily went, mmm, and then threw it down. That is, a, that is a bog standard pepperoni pizza. Mm -hmm. Thin crust pepperoni pizza. <laughs> that same sort of doughy feel. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think it suffers from the same issues with not knowing what temperature to cook a pizza at. I think this tastes like pizza you would get at Blazer Tag. Mm -hmm. <laughs> In a good way. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, good way. Sometimes that's the pizza you like. Like cafeteria pizza. Tombstone pizza. Mm -hmm. uh, it is like Tombstone. I would eat that. Mm -hmm. You know right now. <laughs> 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 and finally. Oh, boy. oh God. God. This is going to be so gushy, I think. Yes. <laughs> I'm going to save this just as a... Uh... Palate cleanser for like. <laughs> okay, who wants the um, the onion side and who wants the just regular Branson side? I'll go onion. Nick is so into this. Mm -hmm. Oh god, now I'm scared. Nick is like ready to try anything and also go. Ooh, <laughs> it's good. That's so much cut. What are you? Oh my god. Oh. 
The impression I get from Nick in these moments is that Nick oh. really likes being alive. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Dude, really, you just like into life. And you're like, I'm just going to do it all. I think Nick is a guy thing. who really watches what he eats around the house and does a good job about it. So when it's time for Face Jam or <laughs> Face to do a pizza day, he goes, all right. And that's it. Hang on. <laughs> What happened here? We've gotten a, a camera person. <laughs> Definitely wants to try some. Definitely. <laughs> Definitely. Oh. It, oh, I got a big ass chunk of egg. Thank okay. you. Okay. Now, here's, here's my initial assessment before biting into it. Yeah. It stinks. <laughs> <laughs> there is an odor. When I was holding the laptop earlier, there it is has, a distinct odor. It has a, yeah, a stink odor. You're right. 100%. All right. Um, down the hatch? Yeah. yeah. I'm going to go get a drink. <laughs> yeah, absolutely, man. I got Diet Coke and Diet Coke. Hey, can I have one? <laughs> is this like an onion odor? Like, what is the scent? Would you say? Uh, well, it's. I, I think part of it is it's pickled and it's chutneyed and it's oniony. Oh, so it's like a it's like a vomity sweet and sour. Uh, hey, Jeff, you're out of sodas. <laughs> I got one outside. <laughs> all right, do we want to all buy at the same time? Yeah. Oh, God. I'm gonna go for the tip, and I'm also gonna go and grab some crust after. Yeah, it's oh, oh, it's so wet. Okay, here we go. It is. Stop! Why are you stop burping? <laughs> I gotta make room. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Ooh, that is. You know in like a horror movie when like in a found footage like all the audio cuts out when the worst thing happens? That's what I've experienced. Like I can just tell this is the worst part of this pizza eating. Did you go crust? Yeah. I, I don't like it. <coughs> I don't like it at all. Why would why would Papa John's make that? I cannot recommend that. <laughs> <laughs> Some of the Well, you know what though? What? It's kind of complimentary flavors. Well, this is, <laughs> there's nothing that's sticking. There's all like, <laughs> hold on. <laughs> As opposed to insultory flavors? I feel insulted. Yeah. Ugh. It's. It's. Oh, it's. Gavin, it's like inedible. <laughs> I got way more onion that time. Oh, the pickled no. onion. <laughs> Nick keeps going. <laughs> it's pizza day. It <laughs> pizza day. He's got to go. <laughs> Who knows when I'll have this shot again? Dude, the crust is good. <laughs> That's good crust. I told you. With the bread, oh, this brand is almost this is almost edible. Stop. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> These are flavors I don't think I've ever like really had. I don't like how Branston pickle can be crunchy and soft at the same time. <laughs> Ugh. You love it. He's just going to town. <laughs> <laughs> just like, just like his mum used to make. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Gavin's looking for paper towels. He's doing a great job. And if you want to bring a few of us some, that might be pretty cool. <laughs> oh, thank you, my man. The stuffed crust is good. So no, yeah, it's good. No, I gotta say the crust is great. It's great. You enjoy the Branson pickle crust? It's I do. Good. Yeah, that works well, for me. Mm -hmm. There's a problem in the middle. It's, here's the deal. <laughs> I feel like we may have a little bit more of uh, refining work to do, or maybe not. Maybe we just, we can, we can through context clues from making this first it one. It wasn't recorded. No. <laughs> none of that was recorded. Hey, we just found out that none of our video was recording. <laughs> not any of it? No, I don't think so. We I just, just got that one right now. That's okay. That's, that's all you the audio's good. Oh, I stopped when you served me. I think it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, I think we've got some of it. We got none of us eating my pizza. Oh no. Uh, <laughs> should we film that? <laughs> it's like two clips. Of, okay. Uh, a pickups of eating my pizza. <laughs> Emily, uh, Emily's, ju <laughs> Emily's just like me. <laughs> We're both professional filmmakers. Hey, you want to eat some of mine? We gotta try get and get. Oh yeah, we need footage of that. <laughs> yeah, get, 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 all right, here's. All right, let's explain. Eric loves an intro. Okay, let's explain what happened. 
Uh, there was a problem with the filming, and uh, we lost all of us eating Gavin's disgusting pizza. So, so now we got to eat it again. Eat it again. Now right. I will say, lost is a strong word when we never had it to begin with. <laughs> lost implies it was something we had, and we don't. Yeah, get get that egg on there. Yeah, definitely don't want to miss the egg. All right. I would say get get that bite and then get the crust as well. <laughs> Come on. It's not that bad. It's not bad. <laughs> I like 18 flavors I've never had all at once. Here, I'm for you. Oh, yes. Uh -huh. Yes. Eric. Nick's a fucking freak for this shit. Oh, there's pickle lily on that for sure. Oh, yeah. Eric, get the, get the bite of the front with the egg. Oh, I've got... It's why... Listen. Oh, I didn't get that flavor at first. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, honestly, every bite I've had of it is completely different. All different. <laughs> I really might be sick. No, yeah. every come bite on. Every bite is a snowflake, Eric. Why'd you do this? On purpose. <laughs> oh, maybe you should get it on camera too. Oh, Emily should have some. I think it might not be good because it doesn't have egg in it. Yeah, oh, that, that. Yeah, it'll. Be yeah, the good. egg is the problem. <laughs> I mean, I got a little piece of egg for you if you want. No, no, no. I don't it's, like eggs. It's pretty crispy from about 18 minutes of boiling. Oh, it's <laughs> mm -hmm. like sweet onion and pizza sauce. You got some. I oh, know. <laughs> I have a drinking problem. Mm. Um, yeah. So you like the plowman's pizza? Yeah, do you want to get some I mean, crust? Oh, yeah, I think I've heard the crust is the best part. Mm. <laughs> I hope you don't get the bite that Nick did a second ago. It's the char. I don't know who's. <laughs> <laughs> and, and get the front, get the egg. Mm. Go, get the go, egg, go, go, egg, egg, egg. <laughs> Eric, get the egg. Egg, 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 egg. It's all food, Eric. Egg. <laughs> I can't. I got. He literally almost threw up down the pizza. <laughs> he just so if you're just watching the, the video. crust purple. <laughs> If you're just watching the video, we do have audio of all of the original bite eatings. So go back and listen to that. It's the full picture. Eric, are you really not going to go for the egg bite? I really don't know whether I can. <laughs> <laughs> I think you can. It's like egg chutney. You got it. You got it. Come on, man. Just remember it's uh, onion. What, what are you doing? <laughs> How do you know? Just remember it's all food. You like eggs. Yeah, it's all going there. You like pizza. You probably like chutney. You bought all these ingredients. I did. You did. Yeah. I think looking at it is making it worse. Don't look at it. Just close your eyes and go to town. <laughs> oh, it dripped on all the wires. Oh, <laughs> I got a pick a lily a, drop. That's a Nick problem. <laughs> Eric carries this. This is his problem. <laughs> okay. Go on, my son. It's making it worse. <laughs> down the hatch. Got this. Big boy, brave boy. Big brave boy. Oh, big but look how strong you are. Look at those strong fingers. Look how, look how, look how brave you are. Big, strong, brave guy. <laughs> what would Fernando Tatis do? Steroids. Yeah. <laughs> it just tastes like egg. <laughs> Yum. Is that kind of egg? Yeah. Everybody likes eggs. <laughs> it's like when I try to tell my kid something's good. Yeah. Like it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's the face the lady made when I proposed to Emily in front of her. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I told them, uh, you haven't heard it, but I told them that nobody there was into us getting married. No, no. Yeah. It was fun when we have this major Annoyed. life moment, then get back on a tour <laughs> and just sit there. <laughs> Just like no one gives a shit. Congratulations, by the way. Thank you. Congratulations. <laughs> this fucking sucks. Wow. <laughs> I mean, it definitely wasn't good, but I would, I mean, I ate most of my, well. Right! These are all flavors that you know. <laughs> <laughs> I've never had that kind of pickled onion or that chutney, but. <laughs> Is it the worst pizza you've ever had, Eric? Yeah. I, I mean, wow. like legitimately, like legitimately, I'm trying to think of a pizza I've had that's worse. <laughs> and there's never been a pizza that almost made me throw up while taking a bite. <laughs> like you've never been, you've never eaten a piece of pizza before that turned you off of pizza. Mm -mm. Yeah. I mean, I'm eating a different pizza to get the flavor of this pizza out of my mouth. Yeah. <laughs> Watching you move that pizza closer to your mouth and then you gagging and burping over it was so Vile. Bad. Vile. Vile. I hate it. Um, okay, so I think rate, like scoring. 
Scoring, uh, what would we rate Eric's one? Yeah, what would you rate my tiny pizza? I give your tiny pizza an 8.75. Okay. Gavin? Uh, probably six and a half, 6.5. I can't, it, I can't. That's wait. insane. I well, can't let's wait. be fair, Andrew. I can't wait for Gavin to rate his own pizza. <laughs> let's be fair. It was a very simple pizza. It wasn't very adventurous. So you're losing marks there. But I don't want adventure when I eat a pizza. I did. A I just want crust. it to taste good. Oh, hey, we have a special guest who just walked <laughs> in. She can try it. Oh, she won't. My small wife is here. <laughs> um, Eric made a, sp a small pizza for you. Oh, do you want? Okay, so here's the thing. This is regular small pepperoni pizza stuffed crust. Totally fine. It's no, no. It's 100% regular. It's normal. It is regular pizza. Then Jeff made a pepperoni that was also normal. Uh -huh. <laughs> Gavin made a pizza with <laughs> chutney and hard boiled eggs <laughs> and ham. <laughs> and ham. Pickled eggs. Do you pickled, want to try pickled it? onions? <laughs> Branston pickle. Is that what you pick a lily? Or was it for the bit? It's not a, yeah, it's still, well, <laughs> it was for the bit. <laughs> Gavin the bit. rated my pizza a 6.5. It's stuffed crust. Uh-huh. I'd give my pizza at least a seven. It is a, at least a, it it's is a, a. It's a solid pep. It's just, you know. I, well, I, that's okay. Eight, seven, five. Oh, okay, then how about Jeff's pizza? Jeff's was a bit more doughy and cold, mm. so I'd say six. I'll give my a seven nine. I I'm with I give yours a, a seven. I think it's yeah. it's a pepperoni pizza. Nick, what's your score on both of those? Seven on the little one, eight on the Okay. And okay. Uh, now it's time for Gavin's pizza. Well, it's a two, isn't it? Let's be fair. <laughs> um it's not good. Uh it's not good, but the flavors I think you... every bite was different. <laughs> it's the English cheddar. The English This this cheese is so strong. It's very strong. But then everything stands up to the strong cheese. Yeah. The, so it's just a fight. The cheese basically stands up in the middle of the field, fronting on whoever. And then the <laughs> Branson Pickle's like, I'll match you, you son. And then everyone else <laughs> just squares up to it, and all the flavors match. It is. Except for the pickled onion. I couldn't get on board with that. <laughs> it's absolutely. I mean, two, I think, is. I mean, I'd give it. I mean, I guess I'll give it a one. If it was Here's cooked the problem. better and not burnt, I could have eaten the whole thing. It's a 10 on originality. It's a 10 on creativity. Uh -huh. It's a well, negative 200 on yeah, every 100%. other thing yeah. so there. What, so, so your rating is? 2.7. Yeah. <laughs> Higher than mine? Yeah, maybe 2.7. Nick? I'd give it a three. <laughs> Thanks, Nick. <laughs> Thanks, I appreciate that. Trust is great. Yep. Emily, what do you think? It's an abomination. Well, that's not a number. I think uh, two. No, two. Okay, there two. Appreciate it. It's, I don't think it's a pizza. What do you mean? I mean, it looks like a pizza. <laughs> Like it's a it's a chutney on bread, like that's just yeah. an appetizer. Uh, Barbara, just based on the look. This is one Gavin. Did. Uh -huh. Do you hate yourself? <laughs> um, yeah, but <laughs> but not as much as how that turned out. Okay. Uh, two. Two. <laughs> two based on the visuals. And what was your rank? A one. One. We should call it the Plowman's two. <laughs> <laughs> I will change my score to two for that. Absolutely. <laughs> order, that's what's going to be the recipe, the plowman's number two. Oh, man. I love it. Yeah, I think uh, I would probably do it again without the pickled onion and without the pickle lily. Okay, so hang on. Shut the fuck up. Okay. What are you talking about? The Branston <laughs> pickle was the whole point. Are you... No, pickled onion is different than Branston pickle. No, Even no, though I'm Branston pickle, the pickle is pickled, pickled, pickled onion. onion in the jar. Yeah. The, the yellow stuff. Exactly. He had two different kinds of pickled you... onion. <laughs> He liked one. You didn't have any of that because I, I only did that on half the pizza. You had, you had the best version of that pizza. <laughs> the one bite with the egg just tasted like egg, but it was so wet and firm. The cheese was so strong. Oh, but the crust you, was phenomenal. You had the side of the pizza that he's on board with. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if I, if I made it again, no piccalilli, mm -hmm. none of that yellow floppy pickle, uh -huh. and the rest was phenomenal. Phenomenal, phenomenal. <laughs> but it just needs to be cooked. It needs to be not raw and hot. Yeah. It was hot, floppy bread with burnt bits. It like gave me a headache. I don't <laughs> feel good. That's all the carcinogens. That's probably. Like, <laughs> I feel bad. Okay. Like we didn't even talk about when like that chunk of wood fell on Gavin's oh, pizza. Yeah. And we had to <laughs> we had to separate it from the pizza. You dropped wood on my pizza. <laughs> just like that. Uh -oh. Big ass hunk of charcoal. <laughs> Um, okay, so it, was, it wasn't a win. <laughs> <laughs> but 
But I've learned a lot. Oh, oh yeah? Yeah. That's yeah? the thing. You got to start somewhere. Andrew, how would you rate all these from looks? Did you do that already? Uh, yeah, from looks, I would say that uh, Gavin, yours was a one. <laughs> I, I Actually, I maybe... I don't know if I can imagine a pizza that looked worse, to be honest. It's tough to scale. At least it was a circle. Low, it, here's but I thing. can't imagine a worse looking one. Here's the thing. Gavin, your pizza looked like if a children's TV show was trying to show a disgusting pizza, it would yeah. have cut up hard-boiled eggs yeah. and chutney. <laughs> like, it would have those things, and it would... It, it would be somebody pulling like the lid off the pizza and the camera yeah. would go bow. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> if Nickelodeon <laughs> made Fear Factor, like, that would be a challenge. Yeah. It looks like your pizza is something Mark Summers made kids <laughs> put together. <laughs> wow, wow, they're to crazy avoid kids. Being slimed. And they're eating. Oh, this is wild. This is awful. Okay. Uh, hey, how would you rate uh, Jeff's pizza just based on looks? Yeah, I'd say yours and Jeff's have to be a seven. Just as a minimum, like it seemed like it was cooked. It's pepperoni. There's yep. nothing too fancy about mm -hmm. it. It seems like kind of a basic dough. Like it's fine. It's solid. That's a solid pizza. I, w I will say, I think we made those just to have something to eat. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's how it feels. Yeah. The real star of the show was Kevin's Plowman's number two. <laughs> what a star it was. You ever seen a star fall that fast? <laughs> <laughs> it was a real crash and burn. Uh huh. So, um, <clears throat> Proud of you. <laughs> I'm proud of all of us. <laughs> we, we all made a pizza today. That's awesome. That's Jeff's, true. That's yeah. cool. Jeff's one and only time using that pizza oven. It's so far. Mm. Are you open to using it more? Well, we've been, we were talking about it today, Andrew. It's barely been four years that I've lived here. And we finally <laughs> broke the seal. So any day it's now. It's barely been four years <laughs> getting around to use that big thing in my backyard that takes up so much space. Is anyone having like a bubbly feeling in their tummy? No, because I only ate like uh, two bites of that. <laughs> most okay. of the egg. Interesting. Bubbly feeling. Yeah, just like a little bit of a unsettled <laughs> sort of raw egg sort of. <laughs> well, I guess we should wrap up our pizza yeah. day. Um, I keep smelling it. Yeah, it's not a good smell. <laughs> it's not a good smell. It just stinks. It doesn't. It stinks. Can we identify the, this? Like, I, if you huff all the ingredients, can mm -hmm. you tell us what the pizza stinks of? Onion. It's a sweet onion smell, yeah. mostly. But then it's the Vidalia onion. That's yes. the thing I'm taking but, out, so that's fine. But then egg. <laughs> yeah. But then just simply egg. egg. Yeah. Like it's so sweet, and then it smells like an egg. <laughs> think about think about this, Gavin. I used seven month expired dough <laughs> and cooked it in a waffle iron, and I would have scored higher than. Oh, that. absolutely! Oh, yeah. Andrew, Andrew, and just based on looks for yours, a hundred percent. Your you tiny, scored your tiny little cute handheld your bagel bite is yeah. adorable. Yeah, those are adorable. Good work, good work. I want to, I want to sell stuffy versions of it to kids. <laughs> yeah. like you can sleep with your little bagel bite pizza puff. Okay, we should wrap up our pizza day so okay. that we Gavin can go. I mean, have a. Bubbly tummy. I'm gonna go and have an afternoon. <laughs> <laughs> really something. Um, if you want to watch this, you can. I mean, we'll have the uninterrupted video, except for somebody interrupted it. Uh, but it'll just go to like you know the logo, and then it'll come on back to when we're going <laughs> and resetting. And there's also a video of us making them. There is. There's a video of us making. It might be at the beginning of this thing, oh, but wait. not the audio. I don't know. We'll see. But, maybe um, maybe we'll uh, pulp fiction it, and who knows where it'll appear. Yeah, it'll <laughs> right there. Non-linear pizza video. <laughs> um, a successful office day. Oh, it's a great office yeah. day. We're getting a lot two. done. Two we're for get, two. We're getting a lot done. Yeah, we we watched the monkey movie, and now it feels like the it, like uncorked, like we're ready to go. Yeah, D every day. Yeah. yeah. Um, Thanks for joining us, Andrew. Thank you. Um, for making such uh, incredible pizzas, Eric and Jeff, and for whatever you made, Kevin. <laughs> I appreciate, appreciate it. looking at it. Man, Kevin, yep. catching a lot of heat. Oh, man. The English too, cheddar is just so much. too bad our pizzas didn't catch yeah, any of that heat. <laughs> well, Gavin's caught all the heat at the very Gavin's beginning. Gavin's pizza caught on fire. <laughs> it <laughs> caught shot. Gavin kept going. I've been sabotaged. and then I was and, sabotaged. And then the only part of the pizza that Stay was any it. good, the only part of your pizza that was any good was the crust. I had to bite through the ash to get to the good bit. <laughs> I, thought I, I thought I knocked most of that off. <laughs> With the wood that you dropped on it? <laughs> uh, well, that'll do it. Uh, follow us at Face Jam. Fuck. 
fall. Sorry, wow. it's, it's, a na- it's a natural habit with this amount of Freudian gross food. Slip. Honestly, honestly, this is how I feel after most Face Jam wow. episodes, where you're just like, this you've is got shit. two default intros. One has a Ugh. gut full of nasty food, yeah. and you just went to that one. Uh, follow us at Face Pod on Twitter and on Instagram. You can see all the pictures there. If you listen to this like a freak, uh, you could go on our YouTube channel and watch the video of it. Uh, if you do both, that really helps us out. <laughs> <laughs> Can't promise it's going to help you out. <laughs> um, so thank you very much. Any parting words uh, for your pizzas? I just want to say, uh, my, my last parting word will just be, what a phenomenal job you have taken over uh, doing in season five as the intro-outro guy. And I just really appreciate it. <laughs> Someone really appreciate it. it. After Andrew's confession that he understands intros now, I'm glad that... I'm glad there's an appeal here. That's true. We're trying to reset. We're trying to make it make sense to people who come in on this number episode so we don't have to go, yeah, go back to 16. Like, <laughs> episode 128. Find episode 46 and count backwards until you find the one. <laughs> uh, any, any last words, Gavin? I don't think so. Okay. <laughs> Andrew, anything strong to take us out on? No, I'm sad I didn't get to try some seven pizzas, but I'm I'm glad I and I'm sort of glad I'm not there to avoid whatever the fuck Gavin made. The Plowman's number two. Yeah, this I is to all the Plowman out there. Uh, hey, if you do make your own Plowman's number two, um, please don't. Yeah, really. Send like, us a pic. Yeah, send us a picture, but also rethink what you're doing uh-huh. and yeah. don't plow in the rain. Yeah, <laughs> don't. Yeah, we found that British people don't like what <laughs> wet. Yeah, I don't know why they live there, but all right. Yeah. Okay. Goodbye. Thank you. Bye.